to, to, to communicate with people, you automatically think um, if you want to communicate with someone that's in another country, we automatically think about picking up the phone or doing something on the internet to communicate with them. And you can do it instantly, pretty much, if you know the contact detail. So that's what we automatically do. But obviously in the past, when we wanted to communicate with someone in another country, we would think well, we'd have to write a letter. And we'd have to give the letter to a postman, who would then have to give it to a delivery driver, or a delivery pilot, or whatever. And then the letter would travel to the recipient by that process of one person to another, one system to another. And now when we want to talk to someone, we just pick up the phone and dial a number or click some keys on the keyboard. So I am thinking that that's what will happen in the future. We will communicate with people so easily just by thinking about it. And we'd be amazed that we had to use a device or these systems. And the idea of writing a letter would be almost insane. It just would, we wouldn't understand that we had to do something so awkward to communicate with people. So I really think that's one of the ways that we'll go forward in communication. We won't write letters anymore or send emails or make telephone calls. We'll just think about it and processes will kick in and we'll do it. It would be some kind of thought control. So if I had the any useful abilities, I would start development of such a system. And it starts with analysing brain waves and then initiating contact using some device. So I, I really think this will happen one day and possibly not too long either um, before we can communicate with people just by thinking at them.